Hey boys and girls, I have another Easter book that I'm gonna read. This is called Happy Easter Little Critter by Mercer Mayer. It's Easter morning. I bet the Easter bunny has already come. There's a little critter. I'll quietly tiptoe downstairs and find all the Easter goodies before anyone else wakes up. But as usual, my little sister is up before me. Look, his little sister found the Easter basket. I got a toy egg that you can look into, a wind up bunny, some candy chicken, a bunch of chocolate eggs, and millions of jelly beans. The Easter Bunny gave my little sister the same thing. Dad says that, so we won't argue. Mom says we can't eat any of it until after breakfast. After breakfast, we have to get dressed for church. See them all dressed up. I don't think Little Critter is very happy. Dad starts the car and we all get inside. My little sister likes to get all dressed up, but I don't. At church, I can't see anything because everybody's wearing funny hats. Can you see them? You can't, you can't see because all the ladies in their funny hats. After church, all the kids dye Easter eggs. Do you do that with your family, dye Easter eggs? We do that at our house. I think my eggs are the best. While the eggs dry, we have a picnic lunch. See? Then our parents hide the eggs in the field. We're not supposed to peek. Uh, it looks like they're peeking. Next, we all line up. Just like we do at school, they line up and run into the field to find the eggs. Let's see if we can see some eggs. Oh, I see one hiding right there, right there. Over here. Yep, there's some under the tree, next to the barn. Sometimes too many kids find the same egg. Uh-oh. And sometimes you walk right by an egg and someone else finds it. Sometimes, sometimes the little kids don't find any and you have to help. Look at them helping, that's so nice. But by the time we go home, everyone has had a happy Easter. Happy Easter, everybody.